Venetria Moon Raw Love, and I am honored to have you join us for Serving Tea with Love. I am Venetria Moonra Love, and I am honored to have you join us for Serving Tea with Love. Serving Tea with Love is at our last spring segment for the season before we hit our summer garden series. I cannot wait for you to join us live or virtually. In today's segment, we will be talking about June health observances and have tea with us at the movies. As I take in the last movie at the Concourse Plaza Movieplex. May 28th, 2024 will be their last day of cinema operation. Now, before we have tea at the movies, let's go over that June Health Observance Tea List. You can read how these teas support the illnesses on our June Tea List in the description. And we'll go over some of these right now with you. June is designated as Alzheimer's and Brain Awareness Month with various other health awareness events happening simultaneously throughout the month like Healthy Vision Month. In our February episode, we shared our tea list that will help with brain health, including Alzheimer's. You can click that link below to get that tea list in the description and catch up on our tea journey. And don't forget, June is Pride Month. Serving Tea with Love's June Tea List will go over teas for vision and the top men's health issues. Get the list of the June health observances in the description box. In men's health, prostate health and mental stability are some of the top things men deal with in their health journey. Men can maintain prostate health by incorporating a balanced diet rich in fruits, vegetable and grains, while limiting red meat and processed foods. With regular exercise and maintaining a healthy weight, keeping hydrated and limiting alcohol consumption can promote overall prostate health. When it comes to addressing mental health issues in men, herbal teas can be beneficial in alleviating symptoms of stress, anxiety, and depression. Maintaining vision health is important because vision is a crucial sense that allows us to navigate the world interact with others, and perform daily tasks. Poor vision can significantly impact our quality of life, making it difficult to drive, work, read, or participate in activities we enjoy. Regular eye exams and proper eye care can help detect and address any issues early on, preventing potential eye vision loss and maintaining optimal eye health. And did I say March 28th? It's May 28th, 2024, last day. All right now, let's go over that tea list. Nettle tea, eye bright tea, and dandelion tea are good for eye health. Nettle tea supports stress and damage caused by free radicals, function of the retina, degeneration and cataracts, dry eye syndrome, and it supports prostate health due to its inflammatory properties and the ability to promote urine flow. Eye bright tea supports conjunctivitis and dry eye and dandelion tea reduces inflammation in the prostate. Ladies and gentlemen, this movie don't fail. This movie don't fail not one bit. <laughs> okay, let's go over the second half of that June's tea list. Saw palmetto tea, red clover tea, and St. John's wort tea. Saw palmetto tea and red clover are good for reducing inflammation in the prostate gland and protective effects on the prostate. St. John's wort tea supports anxiety and depression. Yo, it's like utica, 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 utica. <laughs> the surprise endings just never end. Don't forget, I am your Juice Plus Tower Garden representative. 
our fruits, vegetables, and antioxidant blends will give you 20 servings of fruits and vegetable nutrition a day. Ask me how. Wow, that was amazing. You know, I've always did want to do a director's cut commentary. <laughs> oh my gosh. How many years have I had the privy privilege of literally walking outside my building, crossing the street, and right there just walking into the movie theater. Oh gosh, I mean like, it's time for me to go because things is changing. Oh my gosh, right? <laughs> things are changing. I don't know what those politicians did, but why y'all got clothes out there going to movie theater? I mean, really. Now I gotta go, well, I gotta go someplace because uh, the amenities, the amenities are just dwindling, dwindling in the Bronx here. But serving tea with love has definitely shown some love to an icon, landmark, I say, <laughs> of the Bronx. Ladies and gentlemen. We are looking for our I Love Tea tribe. Please help us grow by liking, commenting, sharing, and definitely subscribe. Serving Tea with Love helps you evoke the primal healer within. Join us on the last Tuesday of the month. See you soon.